Hey guys, Bruto here, welcome back to Farming Simulator 2019 and here we are at Marble Manor, part number 10 as the jet just goes on by. Um, so last episode we did pick up the Breedle Fertilizer Spreader, so we're going to have to use that guy, um, well probably not, not today, because I think, um, yeah we've already spread once, so not there either, we need to plough this field, we need to, uh, what are we doing? Um, playing this field and doing the bales and stuff. We need to get this guy back first, so we'll um, head back down with this guy. I have um, installed again the IT runner pack, so I'll quickly take a look, set ourselves up. If we go trailer, uh, is it in here? Are they in here? It's a little bit of lag. Yeah, the IT runner stuff and that is in here. So we'll have a look at those guys eventually. Manual spreaders. We've got an IT runner. Yep. So we can have a look at that. And I think. Do we have a slurry tank on the IT runner? Container. But it does spread. Okay, cool. Alright, so I think we might. um try and get a hold of that guy eventually that'll be pretty cool I think so what I want to do is also uh, drop this guy off here we need to um, grab the plow back out so we'll stop you here for the minute uh, you're there you're sort of in the way of the door but we'll um, move you out of the way there you go we'll actually Reverse back in and pick up our uh, what do we call it? Play out here. Oops! Hit the door. Um, I'm gonna have to set up the worker to go and sort of start play on the other field. Probably get um dumpy in doing this again this episode. Um, yeah, I think that's what we're going to do. I have to grab that tractor. No, not that tractor. The tractor over here we've got over here. Um, get him back bailing. Getting some more hay bales. And then we'll finish off um, plowing this field as well. So we've got a fair bit we need to get done. I'm not sure if we should turn this into like a... Um, a crop field or not. I mean I like the idea of having the grass here ready to go when we need it. So I'm not overly concerned um, about it really at the moment. But what I want to do is back back sort of get ourselves started here anyway, it doesn't really matter where. Set ourselves up at like say 180 so we sort of square it off properly. And then we'll do a run right around the outside and then we'll set Dumpy up in the middle somewhere get him to hopefully try and plough this field reasonably well probably going to have to come back and touch up a few things as we usually always do um, and then go from there I suppose but we definitely need to plough this and reseed this with grass uh, possibly I don't know, see, I think if we do partly grass, part not grass, we might end up having drummers when we come back to um, replow and reseed and stuff, but I will have a look at it. There is a way that we can change that by putting a bit of dirt or something sort of in the middle of the field, running along one end of the field. Good, let's try and Oh Jesus, that's terrible. Try and get some good driving skills going here, which is hard for me to do. Um, run like a row of dirt along the side of what we've ploughed so far. And um, then they shouldn't try and join the fields together. So we'll do our um, 
Yeah, landscaping tool, throw a bit of dirt down or something like along those lines um, along this run up here to split this end in we can put it as a like a crop up this end and still have a little bit of grass up the other end which I think probably won't be that bad an idea to be honest at least we'll have um, some more crop space available and still have some grass left over case we need some more hay bales and that sort of thing. Alright, so we'll stop you right there. I'll bring up uh, this guy, make sure we're sort of heading 90 degrees around about. Hide worker which Really didn't do anything. There we go, now he's going. Um, go through to our truck. Gonna need to unload Jacko here, but of course we're all gonna be on the wrong side. So we might just have to wait a second. Wait for him to get full and then we can back him back. To unload properly and then send him back on his way so we'll just sort of follow him up and he will eventually be full so we really can't we could drive over the crop but it's only going to damage it and we don't want to do that he should pretty much be full so close look how close he is There we go, let's back all the way back. Try not to hit our truck. Chop that off. And set him going again once we've emptied all of this soybean out. So I did plant corn, uh, sunflowers over there, and I just realised we're going to have to replow that again, um, which is going to be an absolute pain. So no more corn, no more sunflower, no more anything we need to re um wow it's taken a little while to get this emptied all right there we go done Keep going back again there we go cycle through can shut you down should not be in the way there get our bailer out yeah, good to go. Alright, let's grab some more bales. I think these are hay bales, or is that first one? Looks like it's grass. Might have picked up a bit of grass before we picked up the hay. Oh well. I'll um, just grab that one and sort of throw it out of the way so we know it's separate. We don't want to try and pick it up. Then we come back with our truck. How's he going? Let's have a look at... Um, he's done a pretty good job at that end. Not bad, Dumpy. Not bad at all. Alright, so we'll get this done. We need to... Um, this one doesn't have the front loader attached. The front loader is still sitting down there waiting. So we'll have to get the truck down here and get these bales loaded up so we'll be able to run over some of this normal grass now that we've already got hay in the baler if we hit grass when we hit zero then we hit grass the first thing the baler will fill up with grass instead of hay but it shouldn't be too bad and we need to do we need to buy some more cows about a hundred thousand dollars so I'm gonna buy fair few more cows um, still looking at um, our truck the s900 SB daybed cab hook lift so we've got the Detroit the Detroit all the Cummins it's only just the power it's all it's changing really I'm not sure if it'll change the sound or anything but 
think we'll just go with the standard to start with and then obviously once we get a little bit more money later on we can um, upgrade it just that little bit we're gonna have to do a little bit of servicing soon too I think we'll be able to bring our service truck out into the field and service all of this equipment here the baler and all that sort of thing we've got on at the moment get all this um, serviced and all that sort of thing we can do that in the night time too actually because we're only running like the truck we're not running any sort of heavy machinery any farming equipment other than just the standard truck really so get that done after hours night shift sort of thing right so we're going to get still going to get a fair few bales out of this field so it's still going to be quite worthwhile for us to keep this as a grass field this section and leave that section up there uh, possibly plant something up there to harvest um, possibly leave it as like a wheat field up here wheat and grass that way we can get our bales from here so our straw bales our hay bales and all that stuff will all be done from up here I think that would be um, quite ideal sort of run through the bits that we need to there's nothing there I'm just gonna turn it off so we skip through that a little bit quicker and hope we don't actually pick up some grass and we're still trying to get hay bales all right there we go head back down Beautiful. So we're getting there. So we're going to have a fair few bales. We're going to have tons of hay bales back at, at the farm. So we're going to need to do some more, obviously, totem extraction, some more straw, some more water, some more everything once we get some more um, animals going. Oh, there's five litres of wool, so the wool must be working. It's just taking a little while. That's how he's... Um, harvester going doing all right so just to go through again this is growing this we're harvesting this we're plowing and getting ready to seed with possibly wheat or oats or something we'll have a look and see what's um, got a decent price at the moment and that's what we'll actually come back and seed it with all right so let's go into our landscaping Uh, why is that not working with where my mouse is? Okay, something's going on here and I don't know why it's not allowing me to use my mouse. Ah, uh, where are we? Let's run this all the way along. We're missing, Jesus, we're missing bits with our tractor. And it's not even going where I want it to go. It's an absolute pain for some stupid reason. I've no idea what's going on there. Can't use the mouse. We've missed a fair bit of hay there, but I'm not worrying about it. Forget about it. Alright, let's try and line ourselves back up this way again. I might go in and see if I can go place like this. No, there's an issue with the mouse for some reason. I'm not sure what it is, but that is bloody painful. There we go. Make sure we're sort of overstepping anything there we go that'll do I'll have to come back and touch, touch that up let me jump out of the tractor and then now have a look no it's got nothing to do with that either so I don't know what that problem is so that'll give us a road in and out and also give us something to separate um, the two fields it'll work not perfect as you can see because we can't use this mouse but think it'll work
Oh, there we go. Let's have a look. That's all right. We've got a little bad spot there, which is meant to be grass. So let's just do that. There you go. Still not perfect, but we'll be able to fix it up when we come back with our um, plow anyway. We'll be able to um, put it on creator field mode and sort of run alongside that try and tidy that up just that little bit let's have a look how's Dumpy doing he's doing a bloody good job actually a really good job today mustn't have mustn't have went and had beers for lunch today Jacko's still absolutely smashing it over there harvesting again missing little bits at the end but we knew we were going to have to touch those spots up Possibly if we had a mouse available, we could probably cut the field a little bit shorter the whole way around, but that's fine. We'll go back and we'll touch everything up. I'm not that concerned. We knew we were going to have to anyway, so it'll be fine. We have a sheep load of bales at the moment. We go into, what is it? Uh, this one. Uh, 46 bales created so far. And still more to go. Probably just over halfway, so I'll probably get a good 80. 75, 80 bales, I reckon, out of just this side. So we've spent a little bit of money on um, um, putting all that mud and stuff down there, just so we can work out the difference between the two fields. But hopefully, it'll pay off for us in the long run, anyway. Let's keep a look out, make sure we don't have any grass bales just popping up anywhere, which I don't think we have at the moment. So that's fine. Um, don't know if I've put it into the into this game yet. No. There's finally like a little ride on lawnmower, which um, I was sort of going to look at for our Rags to Riches series. Little ride on to ride around the house area. Um, so that's available. I don't think I've put in, there's a brand new chicken farm as well that's just come out, which, no, I haven't put into this one yet either, but it does look really, really good. Sort of makes me want to go back to um, doing another chicken farm. We might do that with our Rags to Riches series. We might have horses and chickens. I think we might need to wait a few days to sell our horses though, or make a little bit more money before we can uh, get anywhere with our rags to riches stuff with getting a bit of money because I think they're about $90,000 per um, animal. Ah, it's gone the wrong way again. Uh, $90,000 per building placed down for the chickens, so we're going to need at least 90 grand behind us plus more for chickens. So. It's going to be one of those things that we do do eventually, but probably not straight away. We do have horses going. Um, we will have horses going soon, I think, at our Rags to Riches game. So, we are, I am a little bit further ahead in my Rags to Riches recordings than I am um, with our current Marwell Manor series. So, a little tiny bit ahead. So that road kind of does look terrible, but I'll have to touch all that up. All right, back you into there. Shut you down. We need to cycle through and jump in our truck. Don't know if you'll get to the other end or not. Might even just stop him right now, pretty much. empty him out and then keep him going again. Alright, there we go. Cycle through. Um, not quite finished, but not far off. Did do a pretty good job. Alright, 
one. So there's a little bit up here we need to do. Oh, there's a bale. I think we picked it up from up here, didn't we? So we need to try and remember to come down and pick this guy up. There's a little bit of grass there. It's not bad. Higher right, work up, let him keep going. Ooh, where are we? You're done, beautiful. Right, let's set him off on his way again. So that's a half a load in that truck again. No. Off you go. Uh, you're not quite done, but that's alright. Don't know where this bale's going to end up. It's going to end up somewhere. a little bit. Swing this back around, try and get that last little bit we missed, we might knock this bale off then. There we go. Oh, there we go, pick up this little bit. These little bits. There's another bit up here, just a tiny little bit. And then that bit over there, and we're pretty much finished. Oh, there we go. So a little bit over here. If we flick back through. Yeah, it's only a tiny little bit over here that needs to be ploughed as well. We need to come back and grab all these bales. So I don't know how we're going to sort of get that done uh, hide work out because we're sort of using our truck which we probably do have enough time actually let's start you up unhook you we'll go and grab a trailer load we're gonna have more than have a look here more than one trailer 63 bales so we're gonna have like yeah two trailer loads um, I might just have to grab a load and then throw them off somewhere out of the way so maybe we can come back and pick them up later and then um, leave it loaded again the second time. Alright, so you know, Jacko's not doing a bad job up this end of the field. It's more the other end he's struggling a, bit, a little bit with, but not bad. Let's put a lime spreader there ready to go. Here's the trailer, we'll pick this up. There we go, there's some wool. What's going on here? There we go. Alright, swing around. It's going to be a nice, tight... Oh, Jesus. Nice, tight exit. Should still... Yeah, there we go. Still make it through there. Alright, so we need to go with... Um, auto loader work mode on. Alright, done. So turn him on. Head through, we'll grab all the bales off this side first because we're going to set up um, the plough to get started on this side as well. I think that's our grass bale there, isn't it? So that can sort of just stay out of the way for now. Not sure where he's going, but he's got another bale, so let's go and grab that before he. Ends up too many dramas. Might um not worry about doing this 40 kilometers an hour. Let's just try and pick these up as quickly as possible. Yeah, I don't know. Where, I don't think he knows where he's going. What are you doing, Dumpy? You've done such a good job, and now you're just like confused. Really gonna have to take those eskies out of these tractors and stuff. Obviously, drinking on the job or something. Alright. 29, 30, 31. 
Ah, oh, we missed it. Six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine. They're trying to tell me that two people have finished work. I don't think so. That's even actually working. Oh, there we go. It's auto loader or auto unloader? Auto loader. Uh, unload. Oh, there we go. Look at that. Except we've just had some bales fall through the floor. Which is kind of interesting. Let's back this guy all the way down here. Straight through the bushes there. Never mind. Not very good at reversing, obviously. Alright, we'll set you up ready to go again. We'll just shut you down for a second, cycle through. So you're telling me you're finished. So let's go uh, allow create fields boom knock you out of the way try and get all the way down the bottom here I'm not quite sure exactly where this field is meant to start uh, we'll turn that off for now and just turn it on and go. There we go, that'll do it. And press Y to allow us to create fields. Set ourselves up at directly 180 and we'll just run straight up. Then when I get to the other end, I will turn off um, create fields. We'll get Dumpy to head back down the field. And go from there. So... You're trying to tell me you're finished, but you're not. What is going on with this thing? Not quite sure what the drummer is there. Anyway. So we should now have two separate fields. I will be able to um, repaint grass or something back through there, which will probably look a lot better than what it does now. It kind of looks really, really terrible at the moment. Alright, let's turn right. Turn off create fields we're going to have to come back and touch up this little end bit but we'll just get um, Dumpy on his way oh, god damn it that's me, we won't square so I've unhired him to try and square ourselves up there we go, now hire a worker ok, skip through, you are not finished you've got heaps to do Still got some heaps of room in the harvester as well, so I'm not going to have to come and unload him anytime soon. Head north again. If you go, uh, grab you again. Auto load on. Let's go and pick all these bales up, get them out of the way. If you're not really blocked by an object, if you just bloody turn around, you'll be alright. Alright, we're going to have to fix him up in a second. Do a bit of a run sideways or something, I think. So I think all the bales up there are all gone. There's one up the other end. I'm not going to worry about that right now. They can sort of stay down there. Just trying to get this done as quickly as we can so we can keep moving on to other things. But now we've got heaps of hay bales so we'll be able to do our mixed ration properly. Um, Alright, swing back down. A couple more bales to go. Alright, there we go. Now we'll grab as many of these other bales as we can. There we go. Alright, I 
I think we're going to have to yeah, like leave the trailer there somewhere. Um, unhire you and just do a quick run, sort of this way. There we go, look we'll at where the edge of the field is and we'll do a run. Straight across this way. I think the field, the field, yeah, it does. It expands out down there, so that's fine. All right, there we go. Might as well, oh, joy, just so might as well do a run back, but that was terrible. Then head back up the field, then um. Hire a worker again. Get Dumpy back out here. Get him to finish off the job properly this time. All right, go back, right back. Get that little bit. All right, go. There we go. He's off. Um, you're still doing your thing. Let's start you back up. Go back and grab. Our um, trailer. We check our timer. Eh, got a little bit of time to go, so still might be able to get some mixed ration done and buy some cows quickly. I'm just gonna hammer along. Try and get there as quick as we can. I think 40 is too slow. Let's do 50. So we don't, no, we don't need to lime this field. I was sure that we'd already done it. Um, do we need to lime? We do. We need to lime the other field too. Uh, where are you? Here you go. Reverse all the way back. Open this gate. Hook on to you. Might as Grab some cows over here, so black and white we've got. Uh, let's go, say, 75,000 worth. There we go. Scroll forward and grab some. Unload some extraction somewhere. We unloaded here last time. There we go. Let's have a look now. How many do we have? We have 29. Gonna need heaps of straw, heaps of water, heaps of everything. Let's get these guys happy. Right, there we go. So we'll roll forward. I'm just gonna do this by hand at the moment. Go two of you. We need to grab a. Whoop, missed one. Uh, that go in. It did, but it knocked down those other guys. Ah, too tight a turn. We need to grab a silage bale while we're here, and um, a straw bale as well course. So let's push these things out of the way a little bit. Not a shot. Way too far. Oh, I'm trying to damage the tractor too much. There we go. Back this guy back out. We can head back in and drop off another load. We're going to need to load up some straw bales as well. We will reload those hay bales onto this trailer again because we're going to end up with, as you can see, bales everywhere. Alright, there we go. It's going to take a fair bit, so let's jump in our truck again. We'll um, park you just here somewhere.
on higher Jacko and we'll um, go and unload again. So this is going to be, I think we've got weeds all through this field too, don't we? Uh, let's shift Z, I don't think we can see while we're in the air, nope. Drop that off, let's go and have a look, because if we go... Uh, weed, 18 hours. I did change it. I don't know if it worked. We'll have to wait and see. But I did change it to... I think it was like 1.5 or something, I think it was. The growth control, something along those lines, I changed it to like 3.6 or 3.5. Let's back back. Ready to go again. Straight back up the field. Hire a worker. How are you going? Yeah, you're getting the job done. That's the main thing. Uh, you. There we go. Nice. I'll just grab you too. Throw you down there or something. Out of the way for now. Jump in, grab some more silage bales. Another silage bale. Grab another straw bale. Better shot this time. Oh, look at that. In. Oh no. So, where did that go? Sure, we put two hay bales in there. Maybe not. End up with bales all over the bloody place today. Not uh, the neatest farmer today at all. Let's have another good look. We're going to need tons of total trash, but they should be okay for the minute, so we'll back back, we'll go and grab our water tank, water trailer which is somewhere over here, um, I'm going to grab a full load of straw as well, we've got all that on the ground but I don't think we have, did I buy a bucket to pick that up, possibly we did, do, 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 do. no we didn't, okay we haven't yet, never mind, off the roof, not a good shot at all, that was a good shot, it's like Michael Jordan, eat your heart out, not a good shot, that's a LeBron James shot that one is, yep, yeah, no, nah, no good, right, there we go, Just fit in there. We need to go right down the other end though, don't we, to drop off the straw. Which could be uh, quite dangerous. There we go. How much are they going to take? Well, probably another full load. So you're doing a reasonably good job. Can't complain at all. Draw. So 15,000 is about halfway. So I reckon three more bales, and that should be pretty good. Alright, let's throw three more in. We're certainly going to need some more straw bales pretty soon. Well, not really soon, but. Every time we harvest, we don't need to leave the straw behind anyway. We can turn the straw swath off, so we don't need to do it every time. The 
water trailer is in there, so we can grab another full load of water. I'm not sure we've got water on board already, so that's all right. Uh, where are we going to go? It's just like bales scattered everywhere. We'll just head this way. Run down this way as well. Uh, gate's already open. Luckily the cows know not to go anywhere or I'll be in trouble. Alright, so unload. Keep an eye on it. We're going to need a fair amount, I think a fair crack of water. Maybe another load, maybe two loads. So we've got our milk production up and running, slowly, getting there. We're going to have slurry and all that sort of stuff, so we're going to need to put some silage in this silage pit over here as well. Plenty of stuff we need to still do. Silage pit just there. Got enough room to sneak through there, that's good. So here's our water tower that we placed earlier. So we'll set you up ready to go. Yeah, how's he going actually? He's nowhere near full yet. You're not doing a bad job. There's really not much you can do. I've got everything sort of sorted. Um, no, we're pretty good I think. I think we're good for nearly everything. Alright, one thing I do want to look at is, um, this shed's nice, but we need a shed. Uh, how much money? We don't have much money, that's the only problem. And, nah, let's not even look at that now, not with the way we can't place anything for some reason. I don't know why, it hasn't done this before until now. So there must be an issue somewhere, but anyway, we'll head down and um, fill up the water trough with a little bit more water, another 8,000 litres. I don't think that'll still be enough. Um, we're going the wrong way. Right, there we go, this way. This gate should be shut, it really should be. So when we go through and fill all this out, fill all this up, we'll um, have to come back through and um, shut that gate when we finish with our last, our last sort of um, harvest, last sort of, I wouldn't say harvest. I'm trying to get a decent screenshot here. Something like that. There we go, that'll do it. Oop, hate it when that happens. Alright, so that'll be our screenshot. Getting some more cows around, and this is a very, very good cow pasture. Very, very well made. Look at Jay's block one object, which is our harvester, I believe, so we'll go and check on the Jacko. Quickly start this filling up again, have another look. Yeah, probably another trailer load or more, even. Okay, let's go do a run this way. Turn around and do another run the other way. Then get it going again. Um, how are we going? Yeah, still doing some pretty long runs, so still going to be doing this for, a, for another episode, possibly another two episodes. In the way that this harvest is going, it's taking a fair while to get it done. Uh, we may end up upgrading our harvester later on. Do we actually own this guy? That's the next thing. I think we do. Yeah, we do. So we can upgrade eventually, probably not to a John Deere harvester. Might, um, there's our timer, might have to up 
upgrade to another one. Alright, so you're thinking you're finished. You're probably not, but let's have a quick look. Let's do a run this way. Um, and then a little bit down the bottom, so that's fine. We'll quickly get this done. It's actually running with headlights on. It's not even that dark, but... Alright, so we still need more water. We still need some hay and silage. We still need um, some more straw. So I'll get all that done as well. Possibly off camera to sort of top up the, um, the straw and... Um, even the mixed ration might top that up as well. Off camera, so we're all good to go. I've got to come back and lime both of these fields next episode, possibly, and um, lime this one, lime this one, seed that with grass, seed this one with, let's say, wheat or barley or something, whichever one's got the best price. Oats are a great price again, so possibly oats. And um, we'll still be able to get some more straw bales out of it. Might even try and put in somewhere where we can actually store the straw directly so we don't have to actually turn it into bales. Because I'd like to eventually, whoop, 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 once we get um, enough money to get a mixing vehicle, so obviously our. Um, one of these guys get one of those guys we will try and avoid using um, bales at all we'll be able to get collect the grass straight from here dump it straight off into a silage pit we'll be able to then put the straw and hay straight into a hay loft we won't have to worry about bales anymore which would be great save us a lot of time bailing and collecting and unloading and all that sort of stuff all right there we go so that is now done so fold this guy up put this guy away and we'll quickly go and check on our other tractor oh, what's of that Hit part of the tree, don't I think? Whoops. Um, so we can put all this stuff away now, and then we can use our our truck now to come and service absolutely everything. So we don't have to worry about stopping in here. At the end of every day, we're going to have to make sure we come and service everything. It is now it's that three o'clock in the afternoon, so we don't have much time left before we need to uh, park things up. As you guys know, if you've been watching this series from the start, we have a 7pm, 7, 7, 7 a.m. curfew. So we cannot be out on the field or even driving around our farm in our tractors after 7pm or before 7am. So we need to be um, pretty careful and also pretty mindful of everyone who lives around in the area. Um, this guy, I think we might just park this up here somewhere because we're not even using this next episode. We'll be using our lime spreader next episode. So quickly pick this up. Uh, move him out of the way as well. We might park him next to the planter, but on the other side. might reduce the speed now just because next episode might be a little bit funny otherwise um, you're there stop you there go down and empty you off and then we're going to have a load to take and sell first thing next episode so that's more cows or that's more machinery that's more something more money in our pocket possibly even more sheep if that's what we want to do not sure if we actually did go pallets. There we go, egg pallet. Uh, 
Alright, so we need to get these. I don't quite know how they work. It's one thing I haven't actually looked at. I think we possibly have to sit them in the actual loading spot. And they'll load from there. I'm not quite sure. But um, I'll take a look at that off camera of course. Alright, there we go. Jacko ahead and off again. We'll cycle back through. So you're full. Next episode we're emptying. We need to do some seeding next episode. You're not doing anything. We need to quickly dump this water off. And then we'll um, end the episode. So um, hopefully you guys have been enjoying the series so far. It's been pretty successful on the channel with views and comments and likes and stuff. So keep that up guys. As I always say, if you enjoyed it, hit the like button. Uh, leave a comment if you have any ideas or if you've been enjoying the series or oh, Jesus, certain things you would like to see but not see, we'll leave it in the comments section. If you're new to the channel and have not subscribed yet, guys, please do so. It's been Bruno. Thanks for watching. See you again soon.